What is up everybody and welcome back to Dieter Plays, where I like to keep you guys updated on the latest and greatest in Roblox, any kind of leaks, any kind of news, free stuff, and anything that's really going on around the platform. So given that, I've got a lot of stuff here to discuss in the vid this video to get you caught up on the latest in Roblox news. First thing right here, we've got a leak here, International Fedora for Thailand. So that is pretty cool. Congratulations to all of you who are in Thailand. This is a pretty nice looking fedora. These are always free not sure when this one's gonna come out sometimes it's a, a couple days sometimes it's like a week or two till it's been leaked then it actually shows up on the catalog but these are always free if they haven't made one for your country yet then just hang tight eventually they're gonna make one for your country uh, speaking of which they actually did just make one recently and I mentioned it in a video uh, it happened kind of fast but I just wanted to keep you guys updated uh, just in case you missed it the international fedora for Australia did come out last week and this one of course is free looks really nice very similar to the one for the UK but then of course colors are similar between both the countries and also in the US uh, but then you got that uh, flag right there for Australia so congratulations to all you guys in Australia and when that one is actually out for Thailand I will make sure I let you guys know in a future Roblox news video so now moving on to the catalog lots of changes here to talk about there's some new things and then there's also some new uh, UGC people and then there's something about the youtuber UGC that we want to keep you guys updated on and then a sneak peek at what is next from me in that catalog but uh, we've got these two new uh, avatar animations that I wanted to take a look at this one right here the air dance it's 150 robux but it looks like he's one of those wacky wavy inflatable arm failing tube mans doesn't it it looks like one of these things that's basically what we're getting it's basic that's the air dance guys it's the wacky wavy inflatable arm flailing tube man or whatever they call it I'm not sure exact name for it but the description is feel the wind in your hair so that is the air dance a little wacky all right they've got this other one only 25 robux very very uh, very proper how do you do it's the curtsy so I don't think I need that one but you know all these people with these UGC items there's all these dresses and things so it almost would kind of work properly for a lot of these games I need to go get some more avatar animations you guys I'd like to know in the comments what are your favorite avatar animations Animations. I mean, I've got the hype dance and I've got some other ones, but I haven't really spent any Robux on some cool animations, but I need to do that. So let me know which ones you guys think are the best. Uh, moving on here, you can see in the catalog, there's uh, something new here from Megan Plays. And you may remember that our uh, that Megan Plays already had a UGC item. So this is her second UGC item. This is the unicorn plushy hat. So yes, that is just an indication to you guys that uh, us people who are in the Video Stars program, we we did get an opportunity to have a second UGC item. Sounds like we might be able to get one every four to six weeks to put up there. So I've got my second one up there for approval. I can give you guys a sneak peek. Uh, look at this. This is my uh, basically the hydro dipped top hat that I made over here in Blender. I actually made this one here uh, myself. So if you want to kind of take a little bit of a closer look at that thing all around, this is this is a little bit of a closer look at this hat that I made. So hopefully I've got it positioned properly and they can get it approved. Uh, if anything, I might have to reposition it. Sometimes I had to do that a couple times with the items, but uh, hopefully this one will be out and I'm not sure how much to charge for it. What do you guys think? Like uh, 75 Robux or I don't know. Uh, anyways, uh, this one, whenever it gets approved, it will be out. So uh, I've also got an idea for my next item and I think that one's going to be really cool. I'm going to be working with a builder uh, on that one and as somebody who does not have UG see yet so we're gonna be able to split that one uh, I came up with the idea but I think it's gonna be a really really popular item so I can't wait to tell you guys about that one but we still have to do all the modeling and the texturing and everything to make that one uh, but it's gonna be really funny and I think you guys will enjoy that one regarding these UGC things I know some of the devs are a little bit disappointed and they don't like the fact that the youtubers are getting opportunities for UGC but a lot of them are also bringing in you know the talents of some other developers as well and guys uh, these like in order to make like really good money off of these things you do need a consistent amount of items and most of the other UGC developers that have been approved they get about I think five a week and I know that they're going to be extending UGC to a lot more creators throughout 2020 and speaking of which the extension of UGC out to creators we've got some new creators here on UGC so if you guys see any new creators popping up in UGC uh, that I haven't mentioned just let me know I kind of want to 
cover them and introduce them to you guys uh, as they start pouring in. But guys, trust me, a lot of you really, really talented builders, you are going to get more access right now. Roblox is just trying to figure out the process at this point in time. However, I think their ultimate goal is to be pretty much just like the t-shirts and the pants so that everybody can make items if they want to. But again, they have to get the process nice and refined. But we've got two new people here. It says, I don't have a use is one of the names and LZD. I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly, but they all released a couple new items in here. Some pretty cool looking items. So let's take a closer look at these that we've got over here. Let's see. So that was the unicorn. We've got Nebula Eyes here, but I don't have a use. Uh, this was promoted here by Beism. So if Beism backs this person up, I definitely agree. And this is a pretty cool item that they've made right here as well. I'm not sure. The Nebula Eyes. That looks like it's going to be an interesting little face mask to wear. Uh, this one right here, the Acid Green Respirator. Now, I could have sworn that I saw a respirator similar to this one. I did find some, some stuff that are kind of close, like this one right here, the NV Half Gas Mask. But you can see there's quite a bit of difference in the way they look this is like halo 1 versus halo 3 sort of face mask you know and then this one right here is a really cool respirator but has quite a bit of a different look now if it was green it might be a lot more similar next one right here the red void gas mask another one made by this new one uh, I don't have a use doesn't that look a little bit like a star lord mask I think if you get this item and the right other items you might be able to make yourself look quite a bit like star lord because the star it's the iconic Iconic red eyes mostly uh, but I think it is a really cool looking mask that they've made over there so uh, we've got another new person here it's LZD who is a new developer here in the UGC this is the bubblegum pink hairdo that they made uh, they made a couple different hairdos just like this uh, except textured different colors there's a black one there's a blonde one and that's three of the items the next type of item that they've got up here is this dark heart bow there's another one that's actually pink so there's uh, two different colors basically variations of this bow right here but kind of a nice little Valentine's thing to get on there so uh, some of these people are starting to think about the Valentine's thing and get that going forward for the UGC catalog moving on to more in the future of Roblox a little bit of a leak that we've kind of learned about here so we've talked about this future is bright the 2.5 phase release here and we looked at some of those games really 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 cool looking they've done an update in uh, jailbreak jailbreak looking even better when the light shines shines off of things. You can see the textures look better. They've got the updated grass, but uh, there was some questions here uh, above talking about these skyboxes that haven't changed much since the beginning of Roblox and talking about how this is concerning to me as a developer. I often have uh, envious of capabilities of other platforms in this regard. So they're talking about uh, some changes here that Soybean mentioned. And moving on, uh, Roblox staff, uh, Zoox CG just responded ETA 2020 so this year and it says for real this time whoa okay guys so that is really cool that is big news for the developers on the platform the fact that they've got some new capabilities here the the light is getting better the rendering is getting good the grab the, all the graphics the grass now they're gonna get these new sky boxes uh which are gonna have like sky altering objects it's like wow this is going to be really cool, and it's going to make the whole thing look better, and I, I'm excited to see that Asimo is excited about it because they continue to update the game, and that's why Jailbreak stays pretty close to the top most of the time. Moving on to another topic that we're updating here uh, that we talked about in the past here in these Roblox news videos. Uh, right here, Andrew Brezza was kind of saying some negative things about Roblox star video creators, and, you know, I was trying to bridge the gap if possible, but it was kind of nice that he, you know, clarified. And, you know, at least said something right here that it wasn't just like a full everybody like is horrible it says many Roblox YouTubers are a beneficial part of the community it's the bad apples abusing influence they shouldn't have from an exclusive program that doesn't self police who is ruining it for everyone go send love to honest YouTubers who have a passion for what they do so that is pretty awesome guys I think this is nice that they kind of reach out here uh, Andrew Bereza and kind of saying you know it's just kind of like the bad ones uh, don't let's not throw everybody under the bus just because they're video creator uh, also you know just but keep an eye on those ones that are the bad apples and I definitely think that we should encourage any of those bad apples to stop doing anything that could be violating the rules on the platform and make
make it so that everyone in the in video star program basically has a good name of course slightly swept under the rug this little event right here for the fast and furious make sure you get these while you still can this fast furious spy racers event this is a uh, show that is on netflix they were doing an advertisement here i swear and during the super bowl i think i saw an advertisement for Fast and Furious 9, like, who's watching these things? Anyways, uh, there's these free items. There's these five free items that you can get, and it looks like to, they're available until February 20th, 2020. So make sure you get them while you can, otherwise they're going to be gone. You've got a hat. There's also a free pair of uh, glasses. You can get this drone that follows you around, which is really cool. Layla's racing helmet, and then also Cisco's headphones. All really cool items and all free. You can get them on the, if you just go to the avatar shop, and you come over here into view all items. Relevance, you can go uh, recently updated or low to high. And you will see these items in here. Layla's helmet, you see the sunglasses, you can see all the stuff in here listed with all the free stuff as well. Anyways, that is it for today for the Roblox news. If you're new here, I would love to have you subscribe and hit that notification bell. And thank you so much for watching. We will talk to you guys later.